After General Secretary Comrade Nguyễn Văn Linh's visit to the Republic of India, General Secretary Comrade Đỗ Mười paid a visit to India in 1992. During his meeting with India's Vice President K.R. Narayanan and Prime Minister Narasimha Rao, both sides noted the excellent development of the friendly and cooperative relationship based on similar beliefs. The relationship has evolved over time to meet the aspiration of the two peoples and is an element for peace and development of the region. The two sides agreed to continue to coordinate more closely with the countries of the non-aligned movement as also developing countries to deal with the new world order. Prime Minister Narasimha Rao's visit to Vietnam took place in the context that India was conducting its economic liberalization program with an open-door orientation to pave the firm way for implementing of the eight five-year plan 1992-1997. Coming to Vietnam, the country of President Ho Chi Minh and visiting his residence and working place, Prime Minister Narasimha Rao expressed his admiration towards such a great son of the Vietnamese people, a great and close friend of the Indian people. The Indian Prime Minister's visit to Vietnam marked a new developmental phase between the two countries in the fields of economy, commerce and diplomacy, like the agreement on avoidance of double taxation, agreement on visas for travel by citizens of the two countries, etc. In the framework of the Indian Technical and Economic Cooperation Program with Vietnam, in August 1989, the Government of India presented a system of spinning machines valued at 500,000 US dollars and supplied by Lakshmi Machine Works Limited, Quimbata, India, to the Textile Research Institute in Hanoi. The Financing and Promotion Technology Corporation, FPT, under the Ministry of Science and Technology and Environment of Vietnam, with the assistance from the Government of India, has developed a process for software manufacture in Vietnam. In early 2000, FPT opened a representative office in Bangalore City in Karnataka State of India to cooperate in manufacturing software programs. Moreover, the Government of India has also granted a credit of 5 million US dollars for establishing two software development centers in Vietnam. President Trần Đức Lương's visit to the Republic of India in the 12th of December 1999 took place while the fraternal India people were preparing to celebrate their 50th anniversary of the founding of the Republic. This visit marked a new era in the multifaceted relationship between Vietnam and India. Both sides signed the agreements on credit, cooperation between the Vietnamese International Cooperation Institutes and the Indian Institute of Diplomacy, as also MOUs on information technology and construction of two software and power training centers in Hanoi and in Ho Chi Minh City. The House of Indo-Vietnam Friendship has been established on the basis of the close relationship between President Ho Chi Minh and the first Prime Minister of India, Javala Nehru, who made efforts to nurture it. Many activities like regular exchanges, visits, exchange of views between Vietnam and India have taken place in the fields of politics, economy, culture, art, science and technology and military in multifaceted cooperation on the basis of potential that exists and the demand of cooperation from each country. Over half a century has elapsed since the independence of India and Vietnam. The friendship tree fostered by President Ho Chi Minh and Prime Minister Zhao Lan Nehru between the two nations continues to be green forever. Today and tomorrow, when the chapter of New Millennium comes, the Vietnamese and Indian peoples will try to make efforts to embellish the color of their flags in the sky, which is inherently very bright with untold stars of festivals. Yes, there should be efforts to nurture a tree so as to get sweet fruits from that tree of the cozy friendship, which cannot fade in the souls of the two nations, the Vietnamese and Indian peoples.